Hi teachers, my name is Lise from Ellie, formerly known as ESL Library, and in my demo today I'm going to show you the Read and Listen Digital Task Activity. The lesson I've chosen today is called Homeschooling, which you can find in our Discussion Starter section. So let's look at our activity by going down to the Task Player. Most of our digital lessons will start with a warm-up activity, some vocabulary, and then go into our reference document, which we often call Read and Listen. Let's click Start to begin. The main elements of our Read and Listen activity include a reading, or a text, and the audio, which you can see down here at the bottom. The Read and Listen activity introduces the student to the main subject matter of the lesson that they're working on. This is an activity that you can do together in class by sharing your screen, or you can send it to your students as digital homework and they can read it through and listen to the audio on their own at home. The audio matches perfectly with the text, so you can listen and read along at the same time. Let's try together. Weighing the pros and cons. Homeschooling is an alternative to private and public education. If you're doing this as an activity in class, you can ask students to read the sections out loud, or you can simply play the audio and have the students read along as they listen. When you're finished, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click I'm finished. As there's nothing to be corrected in this activity, the only option is to click try again, or go back up to the task list and choose a new activity. If you'd like to try again, click the try again button which will bring you back to the beginning where you can look at your reading one more time and listen to the audio. So I hope you're able to find some lessons that are interesting to you and use our read and listen activity in your classroom soon. Thank you and happy teaching.